Loretta Lynch now in deep trouble. What's one thing a deep state anti-American official does not want happening to them? Getting exposed in the public. And that's just what happened to former Attorney General Loretta Lynch. On Friday after former FBI Director James Comey revealed that Lynch pressured him to refer to the investigation into Hillary Clinton's illegal email server as a mere, quote, matter, former President George W. Bush's Attorney General absolutely grilled her. Former Attorney General Michael McCasey had harsh words for Lynch in an interview with Newsmax. What makes it egregious is the fact, and I think it's obvious that it is a fact, that the Attorney General of the United States was adjusting the way the department talked about its businesses so as to coincide with the way the Clinton campaign talked about that business. In other words, it made the Department of Justice essentially an arm of the Clinton campaign. That is a betrayal of the department and of its independence to illustrate what clearly, that clearly the Attorney General was essentially in the tank for Secretary Clinton, McCasey said. Absolutely, as if we don't know this, but at least these people are coming forward now. Okay. Now, as far as uh, Loretta Lynch goes, um, I think there's something interesting here, and I don't know if this makes it worse, but I, I think I'm the only one who's basically uh, uh, stumbled upon this. I haven't heard it pointed out this way. Comey saying that, you know, he, he told, uh, he asked Loretta Lynch if they could mention that the investigation was going on into the emails, but this was on the eve, this was on the eve of testifying before Congress. Now, she then says, call it a matter. And he says, what do you mean, call it a matter? Why? Why would I call it a matter? Just do it. So again, he's not so strong. He's feeble. He accepts it. He didn't want to go to a war or die on that hill, as they say. So he does it. But she asked him to do this, not only when speaking to the press or in general, but say this to Congress, because that was, that was the whole context of, of the conversation. So does that make this even more egregious? Call it a matter when you testify? I mean, does that make it worse? Well, what makes it, what makes it egregious is um, the, the fact, um, and I think it's obvious that it is a fact, that the Attorney General of the United States was adjusting uh, the way the department talked about its business so as to coincide with the way the Clinton campaign talked about that business. Um, in other words, it made the Department of Justice essentially an arm of the Clinton campaign. Um, that is, I think, um, a betrayal, really, of, of the Department uh, and, of its, and, of its, and of its independence. Um, to illustrate that clearly, that um, the Attorney General was essentially in the tank for, for uh Secretary Clinton. Do you believe that uh, it warrants further investigation? And could Attorney General uh, Lynch be in, in, in trouble after the fact? I don't think she could be in trouble after the fact for characterizing things a particular way. I, I think it, it certainly uh, doesn't do good things for her record uh, insofar as the, what the public thinks of what she did and, and, and how she performed. There you have it. People are coming forward. Share on Facebook and Twitter if you agree. Loretta Lynch is corrupt. We all know she's corrupt. We all know she's corrupt. Let us, let us know what you think. And again, thank you so much for watching.